Starting an agency is an entrepreneurial endeavor that comes with its own set of challenges. While some agencies thrive and find great success, others face difficulties and, in some cases, even fail. In this video, we'll take a closer look at five agency startups that encountered various obstacles along the way, and we'll explore the lessons we can glean from their experiences. 1. Cellworks Cellworks was an agency that offered an online networking engagement platform for brands. They were regarded as having cutting-edge products and even received twice acquisition offers from Google in 2012 and 2013. But it was precisely this offer from Google that led to their downfall. The investors flocked to the Google deal and viewed it as presenting a promising business opportunity, whereas the Cellorix founder was not awestruck by it. Because of this, the investors stopped supporting Cellorix. 2. Uptrend Uptrend was a consultancy specializing in deal sourcing for M&A firms. They operated under a business model that utilized a B2 lead generation agency. The initial idea was generating leads for reagents through Facebook. The founder, Maverick Lim, first invested in a really expensive course, around $2. He said Uptrend failed because of bad timing, lack of tools, and branding issues. 3. Volpi Initiated by Derek Haney, Volpine Interactive is a social media and advertising agency. Their main growth channel was actually speaking and hosting events. They were able to acquire and grow a meetup collective to over 12,000 members and use it to send people to marketing events. The challenge with an agency is scaling out the services. The number one reason Volpine failed was because they didn't hire the right people or mismanagement of funds. The company peaked at about $40,000 per month in revenue, with $30,000 per month or more in expenses, but Volpine walked away over $70,000 in debt. 4. Bedouin Information Services Found by James Cord, an IT professional who decided to start a business on IT Manager for Hire type model. He built the company with really few resources and tools and started looking for clients. At peak, he was earning PS2500. But after some years, he had to shut down as he realized his business model was completely damaged. 5. Hawthorne Strategies In 2013, Michael Hawthorne Jr. founded Hawthorne Strategies based in Atlanta, Georgia, which was a consulting agency that worked with NFL players to develop their philanthropic foundations and awareness campaigns to address community issues that they cared about. The reason why they failed is caused of lack of a robust pipeline of clients, no business plan, no financial projections of the next five years of how he would scale assured failure. Without the big picture in mind, Michael was lost in a swamp without a compass, trying to figure out where he was going. If you're interested in learning about startups, educational resources, and trends in the industry, subscribe our YouTube channel for more. Don't forget to leave a comment and let us know about your opinion on these five startups failure stories. Thanks for watching.